a one-stop shop to go shopping with our friends at Hamricks. And if you're looking for something to do with the entire family, in this week's Living Upstate segment, we're mixing art with agriculture. It's the perfect adventure for your entire family. Our Living Upstate team went out to check it all out. Take a look. I'm Josh Johnson. I'm the curator here at the State Agricultural Museum located in Pendleton, South Carolina. And I'm Katie Corbin. I work for Pickens County Parks, Recreation and Tourism. I'm here for the Ag and Art Tour. The Ag and Art Tour is a collection of farm site tours and art tour sites that are across Pickens County. Uh, there's 14 this year and this is the first time that Pickens County is joining. This is statewide, put on by Clemson Extension. Our tour site weekend is May 18th and 19th. It will be from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. both days. Between the 14 sites, there are an array of, there's the tea farm, there's museums, there's strawberry farms, blueberry farms, there's a collaboration station, which is a vendor site, but they do instructions and classes. Holly Springs Center does the same thing, different instruction classes, uh, canning classes, woodwork, all kinds of things like that. Um, markets where they have a farm but they sell their products there among other, other things, jams, jellies, honey, things like that. It shows you where your food is coming from, how it's made, who makes it, um, as well as they can give demonstrations and tell you about what their processes are. A couple of our farms are no spray, so that's a big thing that I know people are concerned about on a daily basis is the chemicals that go into their food or put on their food, and some of these farms do not use those at all. Well, here at the Ag Museum, we are kind of in the perfect spot because even though we're not technically in Pickens, we are kind of at the crux where all three counties meet, so it's very easy for us to take part in all three of the trails. Uh, we get involved because it's important for us here at the museum. We want to talk about the history of agriculture, where our food has come from, and kind of the culture and people that make up our farmers in modern agriculture today. Uh, so we cover everything from Native Americans all the way to modern farming, like drones and hydroponics and things like that. Uh, here on our tour site, uh, we'll have demonstrations throughout the day, both from our vendors and here at the museum. We have a blacksmith shop, so I'll be giving blacksmith demonstrations the entire day. I'm excited to just show people, like Katie said, where, people, where their food comes from. Agriculture is a vital part of our state. I mean, it's still the number one industry here in South Carolina, and it's still a very large industry in Pickens County and the whole upstate. Uh, there's still plenty of local places that you can purchase food, purchase uh, cheeses and milk and fruit, and it, it really, provides a closer community connection for a lot of people and it's just important to kind of show where people get their food and I'm excited to teach them that. So this event is great for families, children, um, teenagers, middle age, older people, anybody that wants to get out and see what Pickens County has to offer. Um, I think that they'll realize that there's a lot more places in Pickens County that you can actually go to that you didn't know that you could go straight to a farm and get your vegetables, fruits, flowers. So the great thing about the tour is that you don't need tickets. This is a free event. Each farm site, each tour site, they will be free entry. There will be things that you can purchase while you're at the site, but there is no charge to come in. On behalf of Ag and Art Committee for Pickens County, we would like to thank our sponsors, Pickens County and Blue Ridge Electric Cooperative.